For police in South Daytona, it was a chance to recover a stolen car. But police say the man behind the wheel getting caught in the stolen car was his ticket back to jail. He didn't want to go, and one of his passengers paid with her life. Michelle Meredith has the story. In South Daytona, an attempt by police to recover a stolen car ends in tragedy. Police say the suspect at the wheel of the Ford Windstar crashed into a tree, which killed one of his passengers, 23 year old Jamie Kane. They came around the corner, we heard boom. Police say it started around 10 o'clock Monday night when an officer spotted the stolen vehicle at this apartment complex on South Palmetto Avenue. According to police, 51 year old Owen Dar refused to obey the officer's traffic stop and took off down Palmetto. I would say he was chasing him. He was following him with his blue lights and sirens, trying to commit, trying to do a uh, normal traffic stop. And when the uh, car sped up and wouldn't stop for him, he went ahead and broke it off. But police say Dar kept racing down Palmetto at speeds up to 60 miles per hour and plowed into a tree head on. Dar and both his passengers got out of the Ford Windstar, were detained. But then police say Jamie Kane, who was in the back seat, complained of stomach pain, was taken to the hospital, and died from internal injuries. What would you say to anyone who would blame police? Well, there's no reason to blame on the police. The police officer spotted a uh, stolen car. He uh, then tried to recover the stolen car and uh, apprehend the people that were in the car. It could have been prevented. If the guy would have just pulled over and take his punishment, this girl would still be alive. Malena saw Jamie after the crash, was shocked and upset to hear she died. Wow. It shows you what. You should just pull over. Pull over. Owen Dar ended up in the hospital and is facing a host of charges, including grand theft, auto, aggravated fleeing, and fugitive with an open warrant. Police say after the traffic homicide investigation, Owen Dar could be facing additional charges, including manslaughter. In Volusia County, Michelle Meredith, West 2 News.